separation, a simple word but with loads of history. Its origins date back to the late Middle English, but is rooted in the Latin noun separatus, meaning disjointed or divided. The Latin verb separare can be split into two parts, se, which means apart, and parare, meaning to make ready or prepare. Okay, enough etymology. So yeah, to take apart, to disjoin, to divide, we get it. But there's a lot more behind separation when it comes to andrits. Here's how a smart engineer and scientist might offer a general definition. Hello. Se <clears throat> Hello. Separation is a process to achieve any mass transfer that converts a mixture of substances into two or more distinct product mixtures. The more complex the mixture, the more sophisticated the methods and forces necessary like using centrifugal force. Oh boy, I lost you, right? Don't click away yet, it's gonna get a lot more exciting here. Time for a practical example. Since it's not that easy, we should have Ruben here tell us about the company he works at. Our company makes surface active chemistries and formulations to create high performance materials for customers in a wide range of industries. Hmm, <clears throat> that explanation may not have helped. But you probably heard from Ruben's accent that he's from the Netherlands, where he works for the US-based company Lubrizol. They help create soaps, shampoos, engine, industrial and fuel additives, core polymers, basically things you use every day, either on surfaces or liquids. Of course, Ruben doesn't do this on his own. He needs one of these. Well, actually several centrifuges. They all work great and get the job done. The problem arises when one of these breaks down. Yep, like that. Companies with this problem can waste more than 100 hours a year in downtime. Less productivity, of course, equals less profit and less products, so not a good thing. So how does Andritz help companies like Lubrizol? They developed an impenetrable, corrosion-resistant, and safe centrifuge casing made of fiberglass reinforced plastic. Sounds easy, right? But a lot of effort went into testing various worst case scenarios inside a given centrifuge. In special scientific test labs, Andritz designed their own projectiles in the form of blank ammunition. Launching these projectiles into the centrifuge, Andritz could replicate the trajectory of potentially dangerous materials. After measuring and investigating the results, it was proven that the blanks moving at six times the speed of any part coming from the centrifuge could not penetrate the casing. So yeah, Andritz built the strongest resistant centrifuge ever. Amazing, yes. So the next time you think of separation, don't think of the Latin origin of the word. Think bulletproof centrifuge and 100 hours less downtime. Think of Andritz, Andritz separation.